Hello and welcome back to Dot Hat Outbreak. We, uh, I think only have one mission on the work list. And I'm curious if this may be the final mission. If this is where it all ends for this game. Of course, if you've watched the other two videos, you even know after the, the final story mission, there's still things to do. There's bonus areas to explore. There's, uh, I think that's actually pretty much it, because we did the Grunties already, so it'd just be uh, the bonus areas. They got the final Golden Gob Race Tag event. I keep calling it a race. It's not a race, it's just a tag. But, uh, there's that. There's Grunty Racing, too, which I never touched on in any of the games. And that was mainly because, like, I, I didn't know where to go about to get into Grunty Racing. I could look for it online to figure out where I'm supposed to go. I just haven't gotten into it because I haven't seen any, like, board posts or did and ignored them. Had no word list to be like, let's go participate in your first Grunty Race. And then who knows, might have gotten into, like, some Fast and the Furious type situations with Grunties. Would have been a fun time. But uh, we have we have that one mission on that work list to do. So without further ado, let's get in the game. All right, let's go ahead check that word list. Fleeting follow chaos, known as the cursed area from a post on the board. It is a level 65, which is what our level is. So I am going to gather up some people. We're gonna go explore. See what we got. Uh, Mia's still acting weird. This may not be the last mission. This may be a halfway point. Maybe maybe three-fourths of a point. Because there's still that level 71 area that we need to go to. So 63, 498. else. Oh, she's pretty far ahead. 64. So, Sandra is going with this. Oh, it's you! Wait just a minute! Alright. I may actually have to add Black Rose when I'm going to do somebody else. And then see if it tells me I need to add her. 567. I think it was 529 for Wiseman. Elk hasn't been joining us at all. Uh, Rachel's 571. I think we're just gonna do Wiseman and grab him. Why, hello there. Give me just a moment. I'll be right there. Perfect, and I'm pretty positive everyone's pretty much on their uh, good armor. The chest piece could be updated. Some level 60 armors. Out crest airy robes. Oh yeah, he's got all the level 70 stuff, except for his feet. I uh, could do a better chest piece for Sandro, but I don't think I have any. I've been actually selling all the equipment that I've been getting. Speaking of, um, do we really have anything? Got some flowing robes and a frost harbuck, which could just be sold, and then a couple burning oils that need to be deposited. So, let me go do some inventory management. I'll even check my storage, see if it have anything for these guys. I'll be right back. And we're back. Wiseman has a new weapon, and Sandro has a new chess piece. Uh, didn't check my storage, but I did talk to the NPCs running about. Still looking for the person I'm supposed to trade this three tower treasure piece to. And I uh, haven't seen him walking around here at all. But the weapon that I got for Wiseman, I traded ten silver axes for. So as one of those people who walk around with three weapons, and want 10 silver axes for any of them. So yeah, there we go. He's got a really strong little earth elemental staff thing. 
so let's head on over to Fleeting uh, Follow Chaos. Protected, of course it is. Gate hacking. Is there anything that we're missing? Doesn't look like it. Oh ho ho. Oh ho 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 ho. Oh ho. Ho 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 ho. We made it. By pace to data drain. You go to different areas. Making sure you have enough fire scores. So this is definitely probably going to be a boss battle, but it may not be the final boss battle. I also think it would force you to take uh, Black Rose with you if it's the final boss battle. Because she's like your storyline character. Let's zoom out there. Let's get our fairy's orb. Behind us is a place. Uh, I'm gonna have everybody cast their strengthens. Uh, should I do the same? And with uh, my script, if him redeem, I'll give myself redeem. And you know what? Octorv. Give it to Sandra too, why not? It's a lot of a lot of places to fight. Alright, here we go. What do we got? We got red things. Oh, skills. Oh, fire tolerance. Uh I don't have any water moves. Oh wait, no, I think I do have some a water spell. I do. Also going to go here to Wiseman. Have him just cast first aid. that little data drain creature. Very nice. Alright, definitely gonna have some tough enemies to fight. So, uh, you know how that works? We saw the first match, now you're gonna see the last match, and then we're gonna go into the dungeon. So, be right back. Maruzat! Things back from the dead. 
so I try to get one and like and then data drain him. Now I'm gonna have to heal. And let's see if I can't get a data drain off. Marusa. And let's get back to healing while they're doing that. He lost all his buffs. just now and I got from data draining the first fight to uh, Shin is a really good twin blade dagger it has a wood elemental attack on it too which is nice that's one that we needed and uh, it also has a level 3 light attack on there as well I could show you to break it down we'll get splinter slash which is the wood twin blade attack uh, we also get Storm Rage, which is the Thunder Twin Blade attack. And then it'll also give us Suvele, which paralyzes the target. So, good stuff. And we have three of them now, which means I can give one to Moonstone and one to Natsumi. So yeah, this was a pretty good field fight. Everybody leveled up once. Uh, Wiseman must have just leveled up here recently, so I think he's leveled up twice so far. Because he had a thousand HP. Uh, let me also hit Sandro. Bam, there. Alright, let's go in the dungeon. Let's check this place out. And let's do Arizona. Skills, gotta do their skills. Got a lot of missing. He's not rules up to. Has a very good magic accuracy. Magic that I just wasn't aware of. Here we go, Sandra just leveled up. So yeah, we've had those things. Also fire elementals, so just been getting hit like crazy with water element magic attacks. But they also will heal weak monsters for 400. And then you've got the other ones that will um, revive dead characters. Uh, nightmares, every single one of them. Do I have a... Is my... Darkness Blades. So let's see. Technically, this one is my light attack. However, we did just get Shin. And Shin has a light attack. So, how about we do that? Skill. Hit him with the Storm Rage. We're about to die. Everybody, 
so when everyone's damaged, he's the best to heal us. Alright, let's keep going. First time seeing those guys on the field. Or in this area. My room's hot. This guy. Giving us a bunch of uh, it's a burning oil, blaze oil. Bob. All about hitting up with that magic. Sandro might be above that. Yeah, he's actually using that exact armor. Alright, I'm gonna go back and check this area here because something tells me it's break room. Ooh, fire score. If. Maybe we do. There's, there's clearly gotta be a reason they're giving it to us. Yeah, there's some protected areas. We gotta go back to the other servers. Now we're gonna just need all of those at some point. Uh, before we go in, we want to hit everything because we do be using skills a lot. Especially. Here we go. Alright, risky treasure. Did all that for nothing.
I just feel back to full, so I'm not gonna bother with wise men healing all of us. Give everybody some Rick same. Comes in handy in battle sometimes. Stone call. Is a spell? It is. It's a level 2 earth summon. Oh. Usually just say like summon darkness, summon earth. Stone call. I like the sound of it. Alright, let's go downstairs. What's basement floor 2 have for us? Time to level up next. Fire school. Break this stuff. Healing potions. Well water is what we're getting. No burning oils. I have, I think, over 30 or 40 of them. And I'm pretty sure I traded the burning oil NPC who's been looking for stuff. I'm not 
could have bothered putting on them. So I'm do that really when they're injured. Oh, it's this guy again. Only use magic attacks. Let's see if I can't paralyze him again. Alright, now uh, let's see if I get. Oh, God, he's hitting me. Ah, uh, he's almost dead. Oh. Uh, to hit him, I knew he was physical. It's up the red. I was still like, oh, I'm gonna get a swing in before they take him out. Uh, now we're gonna use Rixine on Sandro. Alright, who's the back here? Mountain Man. Hit him with the magic. Um, I'll hit him with the hangman. I'll miss the hangman. Not your problem. I'll try and hit him with the uh, moon. Should I rush it in? He's out. Wise man will just eat him up. There he goes. Sandra leveled up. Very nice. Golden egg. Ooh, so far, all of us have leveled up twice. What do we got? We got annoying things. Hit him with those skills. He's gone, he's not getting close. Uh, hit him with that storm rage. <laughs> Group, I think it's three, including myself. Here we go, floor three. What do you got for me? There is the final floor. It just might be. We shall see. It's a starfish. Hit him with We're your guns. Different type of starfish too. But, uh, water intolerance. I need fire. Give me fire. I gotta go to the to do that. There's dragon rage. Yes, that's what I'm doing. Inspector Blades. Switch my 
equipment over to Shin. Just give it a redo. Rigsing. It was, but... Alright, now we can activate it. And they're just gonna pause. They're, they're gonna wait. What do we got? Oh, okay, it's just a chest. Sometimes, it's not always a chest. It could be a big, scary starfish. Smiling blade, huh? What is a smiling blade? Level 50 for a heavy blade. Nice. Juke smash. There's a wood attack. Gans Maximo, which is a level 3 earth attack. And then Rig Seam, harmonized target recovering HP. Very good. Skill drain as well. I think it's a Santro sword. Level 43. Don't go. It is critical hit. Mm. I think I may just not give this to Sandro. Then again, maybe I should. Nah, we'll save it for Black Rose. We're almost done with this field. Had I gotten that smiling blade like while I was on the field area, then uh, I would have given it to him. Still one more portal there. I don't even know if we're gonna reach it. Cause I see a big empty square right there. Something tells me I'm gonna be fighting a little boss monster. Gonna be doing a little a boss battle. Let's go to this break room. Get this last fire score. Fire score. If I could exchange them for like the fire scores that we're looking for, that would be better. We got a purple glow, we got a purple glow. Alright everybody. Strengthen up. together now <laughs> so we get wise men at the same time Let's go ahead. Let's see what's the antidote. My 
wise men. Uh, let's see. Those wise men will also cast water spells. I'm gonna have wise men. You're gonna focus on first aid. Keep the turkey. We could finish doing this. No? Alright. Well. Guess we'll just uh, not go back. We'll just do this instead. Now we gotta go back and check the board. So it looks like I was wrong. This was not the end of the game. Like I thought it was. Who knows? Do you think we'll end the game this week? I don't know how far in I am exactly. Uh, that could have been just, you know, the halfway point that we did could also be two-thirds of the way I don't know I don't know what I do know though is that um, a level for equipment and stuff that we come across seems to be right at the level that we're currently at and it kind of feels like we're getting the in-game equipment now I'm level 67 which got big Going. Uh, we're data draining, getting like level 50 weapons. Armor sits around like level 60 to 70. Not really getting anything higher than that. So, uh, yeah. Guess we'll just have to see. Anyways, that is gonna do it for me. Thank you all for watching. And I'll see you in the next game of Dot Hack Outbreak. Bye.